Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here and today we are continuing rags to riches more specifically island living island living rags to riches <laughs> i started this series when island living came out and i've only recorded a couple episodes it's been fun i do like this series but i'm just so invested in my other ones that it's really hard to like find the, the motivation to film this one but i'm still into it i still want to do it so i'm just not gonna upload it as often as my other ones, but I'm still gonna upload it, don't worry. I hope you guys are doing really, really good. I miss you, I wish I could film every day like I used to. I think about it all the time, but it's just like, it's just not possible right now. I'm so tired, like all the time. <laughs> but I'm thankful to be filming right now. I'm so excited to get into this video. I don't have that much to say today, so <laughs> let's just get into some gameplay. Okay guys, here we are back on the lot. If you are new to this series, um, basically it's a rags to riches. So our sim here is, her name is Lilo Kalani. Her parents died and she, her parents are from the island, but she had never been to the islands before that. So once her parents died, <coughs> excuse me, she moved here to get more in touch with her island roots. So that is her little backstory. Um, she just lives on this small lot in a little hut with her coconut trees, her kava plants, her taro plants, and her pineapple plants. And we were doing some yard sailing stuff in the beginning, but that can tend to get a little bit boring, so we're not um, doing that as much anymore. Also, <laughs> this is so random, but she is actually mastering her rocket science skill. We've been to space a couple times. Um... Yeah, we haven't really f done anything or found anything cool. Like, we got this fossilized alien skull from an alien from one of our trips there. But other than that, there hasn't really been anything yet. I'm just trying to fully upgrade it and max her rocket science <laughs> skill so we can make it to the planet. Huh? No, thank you. Santa is also a clinger in this series as well. That seems to be like an ongoing thing with my series is like Santa is like always present and he's always so annoying. So there's no difference in this series. She actually does have a love interest. It was going to be this guy, um, but they didn't really hit it off that well. So they're just friends now. And then this guy, uh, this is her boyfriend. His name is Kian. I made him specifically for her, but I didn't, I don't know, they just met randomly, organically, so I just introduced them, and now they're dating. He's a good guy. They have a really high relationship, and I would love for them to have kids one day because it is actually her birthday today, so she is going to be an adult. So that means that we need to get kids going because we need kids to keep this challenge going. <laughs> um, so the goal for Rags to Riches is to complete this aspiration and we need like 20,000, I'm pretty sure. Let me see. Fabulously wealthy, have earned 200,000 and have 50,000 in reserve. So yeah, she's definitely, definitely not gonna do that in her lifetime. So that's why we need to uh, start having kids ASAP. <laughs> and I would love to have an island wedding. Like that would be so much fun. So I think we're gonna do that eventually in this series as well. And I would also like to get a blue dog and name it Stitch. <laughs> so yeah, here's Lilo. She's cooking some, I think those are tofu dogs, cool. Um, Her hair, her OG hair. Ugh, speaking of hair, there's one in my eye. It was broken, the CC was broken for me, so I had to take it out and give her new hair. And I was really sad because I loved that hair on her. It was so, um, it was so beachy. <clears throat> I loved it. Why don't you grab a serving? But this hair is fine too. This is actually her mom's hair right here. This is Lucia, this is her mother, and then her dad, Archie. <sighs> they both died, very sad. And this is our enemy, or it was our enemy. But now the red bar is like almost gone. Philippa is one of our friends. 
And other than that, we don't really have that many friends. But I think we're going to have a party oh. anyway. I want to have a kava party for her birthday. So I'm going to buy one of those kava bowls. We're just going to buy one. Pop it right here. As you can see, our lot is actually really... Um, it's very minimal, but I like it that way. I don't really want this series to be like lavish and like bougie and all that stuff i kind of just want to keep it chill she's actually living off the grid right now so i don't even think we can have music which is kind of unfortunate unless is there an a stereo that works off the grid let's just buy this one and we can see if it works okay what else do we need for a party we need food uh is there like a buffet table in this game okay there's this one from luxury party stuff um, I'm just gonna stick that right there and then maybe put the kava bowl on here. And then I think we can have more things on here once we start cooking. So maybe we can like stick these tofu dogs on here as well. Oh, we can. How cute. That's adorable. Okay. I think that should be good. Um, actually I'm gonna sell one of these and grab this because it's just so cute and I can't resist. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. All right, girl, let's go ahead and plan a social event. I hope we have enough money to even do this. We might not. Okay, yeah, we have enough. Uh, we'll do a birthday party. Oh, we need a cake. That means we need a stove, which we don't have because we're off the grid. Oh no, what are we gonna do about a birthday cake? Dang, I wish there was a bakery in the game that we could like go to. Okay, let's just let's just do the birthday party. Let's invite everyone we know. Cause why not? The more the merrier. We'll even invite our enemy. No caterer, because we don't have a stove. No mixologist, no entertainer. <laughs> Okay, and then we'll have it at our place. Can we use this? No, we can't. Oh my gosh, that's so unfortunate. Okay, we're just gonna delete it then. No music. Oh my gosh, this party's gonna suck. It's gonna suck so bad. Oh my god, we can't even turn this on. Oh, this off the grid stuff sucks. Dang. I might change it. I don't know. I don't know. I still want to live simply though. So, you know, prepare kava. No available counter space. Well, what's that? Do we, we really need a counter to prepare the kava? Ugh! We can't even afford a counter. <laughs> oh, we can afford this? No, we can't. Oh my gosh. What the heck? Should we sell this then and buy a counter instead? All right, whatever. I'll change that later. Okay, prepare kava. You and your big old sleeves. That looks ridiculous. I'm gonna have her change. <laughs> Stupid sleeves, oh my God. Oh, we could have um, used our fresh kava from our garden, but I don't think we have any right now. Okay, the kava is prepared. I'm just gonna pop it over here. Get her to grab some. Why don't you grill some other stuff as well? Uh, let's do some grilled fruit. Is anyone is anyone here? Hello, y'all can come on to my lot if you want. It's all good if you come on over. <laughs> Hello, boyfriend. That's a nice shirt you got. Let's change her outfit, actually. Bye. Um, let's do the pineapple one. Uh, Cute. <laughs> Hello, boyfriend. Ooh, Where's that fruit at? Ruby. So boring oh, without baby. music. Maybe we should have hired an entertainer. Hang on. Let me, um, let's see. We don't even have money. I doubt we can afford anything yet. We need $250 for the microphone. 
I love being broke. It's the best. I think we can get rid of this countertop now. We can. Okay. Let's buy a mic. Boom. And then, but we have to hire an entertainer, which is like $100. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Whew. This is just sad. Everyone come grab some kava. This is a horrible birthday party. Maladay! Happy birthday! We need some entertainment, so I'm gonna think I'm gonna get Lilo to either sing or tell jokes on the mic. Let's get her to call to meal, come get fruits, and then I will practice my singing for you guys for some entertainment. How's that sound? She doesn't have any singing skills. I mean, she's all right. Okay, now she's level two, so it should be a little bit better. Is she plugging her ear? Well, that's just rude. I'm just trying to give you guys entertainment here. This is such an interesting party. We got Santa. We got a few island people. We got two aliens with face masks on. Yeah, random. Okay, no more singing. Tell jokes. That might resonate better with the crowd. Aw, yay! Thank you! Everyone seems to be having fun. Like, everyone's not- <gasps> Why did she just slap him? What in the world? Maybe Leela could be a comedian. We can put a mic, like, in public places, and she can, like, tell jokes for tips. Is that a thing? Why is everyone pranking each other? It's definitely not prank day. I love this long parties mod. Oh, what's going on over here? Oh my. Secret, um... Secret romance over here in the corner. Okay, why is no one drinking in the kava? Santa, that is so inappropriate! I'm pretty sure he just self woohooed in our bed. That is disgusting. You, what the heck's wrong with you? You're supposed to be a good guy. <laughs> oh, oh, not you, Simba. It's okay, baby. I wasn't talking to you. She does not look happy. Lila looks absolutely exhausted. Okay, so the kava's gone. Um, I think we're gonna end the party. Everyone seems to be having such a good time. You didn't want the social event to end so soon, did you? I guess not, but like, we need a cake. Someone just, did someone throw up in our toilet? Oh, Santa and, um, what's his name again? Kian. <gasps> there she goes. She aged up. Adulthood, fulfilling dreams, planning for retirement, and midlife crisis await. The perfect time to start wrapping up those lifelong goals. I hope she's not sad. Oh, she's just aging up. Okay, well. <laughs> so many pictures being taken. Why don't? Why doesn't anyone want to take pictures with us? So much. So many pranks. Again? Again? The face mask. Oh, cute. Love it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's end. Yes, yes, yes. It's 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 over. It's six in the morning, so we're just gonna do some of our gardening. Look at all that money rolling in. I can't believe freaking Santa self woohooed in our bed during our party. That is a red flag about him for sure. No, there's another rule that I made for myself, and that is I can't leave the island. Like, if someone invites me to go do something, I can only do it if it's on the island, just to keep it realistic. 
Um, so yeah, that's why I say no to everyone that invites me places. <laughs> Thanks, Kian. You were at my party. I'm pretty sure you told me that in person. So yeah, this um series, it's going to be very wholesome. I mean, it's just me playing The Sims without any, like, without any, what's the word, pressure to do anything. I'm kind of just playing, like, as if I was playing and not recording. So yeah, I hope you guys like it. I know it's a little bit different from my other series just because there's so much stuff going on in all the other ones. She doesn't seem to like living off the grid. Like every time we take a shower in the off the grid shower, she gets like super uncomfortable about it. And you have to take like multiple showers since it's a quick and tepid one. Like you have to do it over and over and over again in order to get like a full hygiene bar. It's a little annoying, I'm not gonna lie, but you gotta do what you gotta do when you're living off the grid, you know what I mean? All right, since we're in a pretty good mood, I'm just gonna get her to explore space. We'll see what happens. It's always like something random. Um, Let's see, attempt landing. I'm not gonna read through all of this because it's a lot to read. I just kind of want to see what happens at the end. She's talking to an alien. He offers, a offers to raise Lilo's ship from the swamp if she can pass certain trials. Lilo agrees. Time for the first trial. Pick a number between one and 10. Four, says Lila. Well done, now the second trial. Hey, this is easy. Easy. The creature continues. Make some lunch, you will. Lilo could forage in the surrounding jungle or there might be some kind of fish in the swamp. Um, I'm gonna say search jungle. After an hour of searching, Lilo lamely offers a couple of twigs. You have failed the trial. I will not help you. Wow. Well, that was pointless. I want to upgrade some stuff. That's done. We need level 10 for that. That's done. We need level 9 for that. Can't afford that. That's done. That's done. Okay, so this is going to be the last thing. Or the next thing we do. Ion Cannon Defense System. $1,700. Oh... She's feeling confident from skincare. <laughs> right on. I'm gonna put this stuff back in our inventory because we don't need it at the moment. Let's just put that there. We'll keep one. Mm. Should we keep this so she can practice her jokes? Ooh, level eight of gardening skill. That means we can do supercell now, which is kind of a big deal. Summer decorations, yes. And you can go ahead and eat those chips still. What do we get, what do we get, what do we get? Little party hats, a flamingo. Well, we're selling the party hats, but we're definitely keeping the flamingo because it's a flamingo. <laughs> oh, look, we got a gnome as well. I didn't even notice that. What, what gnome is this? Poolside gnome, $275. Selling. Hey, we have enough now. We can upgrade our cannon defense system. Go ahead and do that. She's about to level up her rocket science skill again, level eight. She can now build and upgrade faster. I've never done this in The Sims, so I'm pretty stoked to see what happens when we max it. Cute. I love these little fishies and this candle. So adorable. Our plants be looking good. I don't know if I like how like random they are, but it kind of feels more natural that way. Like they're like wild and growing. I like it. Cute little pineapples. How many times can we rummage? Because like we could technically keep rummaging and rummaging and rummaging and rummaging and just like sell everything that we get. <laughs> Is that a cheat? Speaking of cheats, do you guys remember when we would go to the beach and like get the shells over and over and over and over again? It was like a glitch. I'm pretty sure they fixed it because I was trying to do it and it wasn't working. Like she would only get one shell each time. Really sad, because that was like the coolest glitch ever. And that was like our main source of money. <laughs> Holy 
All right, look who came to visit. We were upgrading our rocket, and he came, and now they're taking a picture together, hug lovingly, kiss cheek, embrace. Easy. Easy, yeah. They're so cute. They're gonna have the cutest babies ever. Rapna one. Oh. Should we try for baby? We are struggling hard with money right now, but like... How many more days does she have as an adult? 22. And we need an adult sim by the time she dies. So... I think we're gonna have to. We don't have a choice, y'all. Oh my gosh. We don't have a choice! Cause like, the the baby needs to be an adult by the time that Lilo dies and to take over the challenge. So, yep, we're doing it. We're doing it. There's no turning back now. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'm very excited to see what the baby's gonna look like. You pregnant? You pregnant? No? Oh! Yep. Okay, that was weird. She usually, um, our sims usually, like, cheer when they are on the toilet still, not when they get up. She's like, hey, guess what? I'm pregnant. Look, I already have a belly. I already oh, no. have a belly. <laughs> oh, cute little island wedding. I can't wait. I can't wait. Maybe maybe they should get um, engaged. Look at the way he's looking at her. Uh oh. I smell something bad. That burger looks so bomb. Oh, Sims just makes me hungry. I bought her a rocket science book so that she could get her skill up to level 9. Come on, read the book. Because the next thing that we need to do for upgrading is this right here, and it requires level 9. What are you doing here? You rejected us. I don't even want to acknowledge you. We're friends and everything, but no. And speaking, like, if you guys didn't know, he's actually Kian's roommate, too. So, definitely off limits there. Hey, read the book. <gasps> All right, it's the next day now, and my girl is having a sandwich, and she's suffering from some morning sickness, and also she's tense from warm-ish wash. That off-the-grid shower sucks. <laughs> we get her to throw up. After she repairs the sink, and then she's going to have to supercell, supercell. Spray area for bugs. She's flirty from thinking about her first time, which was in a rocket. <laughs> That's why the little rocket's here. That's funny. She's almost got that skill up. And then we just need a thousand dollars more to upgrade. Yeah, everything else is done. Yo, can you get out of our house? Like what? Do we even know you? No, we don't. You, you can't just come into our house like that. Okay, you gonna leave? Weird! Freaking weird, y'all. Oh, are you guys bringing me food? <gasps> that is so nice of you! Hurry up, girly. Invite them in before they leave. That's why I love about living in Solani. People just like bring you food. Thanks for the food. You can go now. Bye bye. <laughs> I'm gonna get her to rummage for summer decorations like over and over and over and see if that is a glitch that we can use as well. Cause that would be so nice. Ooh, cute. I actually might keep these. <laughs> Okay, we got another gnome, which I'm selling. We got another one of these party hat things, which I'm selling. We got this. I love this. It's so cute. And more of that. Another one of these. Okay. Dang. I 
think we s we're gonna sell this one and keep that one. Okay, okay, let's try again. Let's see what we get this time. Oh look, we got another flamingo. I'm selling that. Come on, darling, get me some good stuff again. Okay, what the heck is that? Oh, that's that porcelain pig thing. We got more of these watering cans, which are worth so much money. We got a porcelain towel. Cute, 150. I think we might keep him. I just like it. <laughs> what else do we get? Was that it? Okay, that's definitely a glitch. Rummaging for decorations doesn't cost anything. And then everything that you get, you can just sell. <laughs> Yo, if y'all are ever short on cash... Hey, we got another piggy. Another flamingo, and another one of these sunflower things. She is so freaking pregnant already. I want to read this rocket science book, but why is it grayed out? I don't understand. Where is it? Oh my gosh, I can't explore space while I'm pregnant? No way! Oh, that freaking sucks. That sucks, but. Can you not? Like, we're having a romantic night in, and you're just, like, killing the mood. You had your chance, boy. You did, and you did not take it, so. Buh bye Third trimester in 20 hours. Okay, so what are we supposed to do now? I guess we'll just wait. Keep harvesting our plants. I just want to upgrade. Is he cleaning our grill? That is so nice of you. Thank you. Oh, all right. She's almost there. Almost there. Come on. Ah. Uh. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Yeah. All right. <laughs> cool. Now we can do this upgrade. Let's do it. Install landing computer. Very exciting. I'm gonna get her to, um, oh my gosh, we can't even hire a service. Holy crap, okay. Wow, living off the grid is rough. It's freaking rough. We can't do anything. We can't hire a gardener. Can't have music. Oh, thank you! Can you water them as well? I have to go to work, see you around. I've never seen that before. Yeah, yeah, we'll see you. Interesting. Super sell everything, please. Oh, man. This is tough. I love our little pork pal. Oh. Oh. Yay, level nine? Holy crap. She's killing it with the gardening. So she's gonna have her kid soon. Um, her third trimester is in 20 minutes. And then once she has the kid, the rocket should be fully upgraded. Yeah, and then everything will fall into place. Once we go to the alien planet, we'll be able to get the alien plants, which will give us a lot of money, as you guys know if you watch my legacy challenge. Um, I also want to like, I don't know, is there anything else that you can do on the alien planet? I guess we'll find out. I'm excited. I haven't like fully explored it yet. Cause like every time I get like invited to the alien planet or like by someone random or if I just end up there randomly, like your sim gets so sick to their stomach and they just start throwing up that you can't really do anything while you're there. So it's kind of annoying. I wonder if like traveling there by your own rocket ship will like 
make it so when you get there you're not sick but we'll see we shall see oh look at this little mood lid lilo is enjoying this whole experience my little bump Aww. How adorable. All right, time to get up, time to use the head. It really doesn't look like there's a lot to do on this lot, but there actually is like harvesting, selling, watering, um, spraying for bugs, cleaning, upgrading, evolving, all while pregnant. She's a boss. Oh! Stop doing that! Heck yeah, just hammer random stuff. That'll work. Alright, she finished the upgrade. Bomb! I think there's only one left now, and we need to be level 10 rocket skill. So that's going to be pretty difficult. Oh no, not even. We're almost there. She just needs to read that book a couple times. Oh no, it's not going up anymore. How are we supposed to get that skill up? Okay, Lilo is in labor. That was really fast. Um, probably because I sped through a lot of it. It was just her gardening and upgrading. So I'm going to get her to have the baby at the hospital. Sure, let's join. Why not? Let's bring Key in. I rarely, rarely, rarely go with my Sims, so switch it up a little. I'm so glad she is giving birth because we need to be level 10 rocket skill and she can't explore space while she's pregnant and that's how you like gain rocket skill. So yeah. All right, time to have a baby. Hello, I'm here to have a baby and I'm having a baby. What do you guys think it's gonna be? Boy or girl? I think it's gonna be a girl. Oh, Stella Casanova? That's Daniel's mom. She is a doctor, that's right. Wait, was she a doctor? I don't know, I can't remember. I just know that she was rich, so it's honestly very likely. It's a girl, I told you guys. Okay, let's see. Charlene, Bridget, no. No, 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 no. We need something. Kiara Kalani. Oh my gosh, that's a mouthful. Let's do Rosie. I love that name. Rosie Kalani. Okay, good. It's only one. Thank God. I was worried she was going to have twins or triplets or something ridiculous like that. I'm so excited. We have a baby now. I can't believe it. baby seems fine so we're just gonna uh, we're just gonna go and explore some space <laughs> does the baby get sent to daycare when we explore space no it doesn't okay she went to space and now she's back how much did it go up not much oh she's not back when are you coming back uh oh our plants are out of season. What are we supposed to do for money now? Yikes. All right, we did it. We did it, we did it, we did it. It's not brain surgery. Have a sim reach max level in rocket science skill. She is now a master rocket scientist. Wow. Okay, we need... One of you guys said that if we just put like an overhang above... It doesn't necessarily have to be like closed in okay i can't figure it out right now i'll figure it out in the next episode how to put an overhang over them baby the baby the baby the baby no 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 bottle feed breast feed cuddle okay okay so the last thing we need to do is this install wormhole generator Hello, sleeping baby. Rosie, I cannot wait to see what you look like. All aged up. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. What is all this uncomfortableness from? Exhausted, brackish water, 
Grungy. Come on, you're almost there. You're almost there to completely upgrading your rocket. You can do this. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> Okay, well, I'm gonna leave this part right here. Um, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, come on. Yeah, okay, we're gonna leave it right here. So in the next episode, we're gonna age up Rosie and our rocket ship will be completely upgraded. So we'll probably be able to go to the alien planet, which I'm very excited about. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you haven't already, please subscribe, come join the family and I'll see you in the next one. Love you, bye.